Hello and welcome to our Kita Kids Zone. The Kita Kids Zone is located in Hoburgstraße 2 in Basel. This is right across the Drei Rosen Bridge in Klein Basel. We are really happy to welcome you in our small Kita. We have capacity for 30 children in our Kita. At the moment we take care of 20 children per day approximately. The children are separated in two different groups. We have the STARS group, which is the baby group. There the children can start at three months and stay there until they are about two and a half to three years old. When they reach two and a half or three years, they will move up to our second group, which is the sunshine group. On the sunshine group, the children can stay until they are 10 years old. At the moment, our oldest child will turn six in January. We are a quite small kita and we like to go outside quite a lot with the children. We think it's more important to spend time outside and play and exercise by like climbing and running around. For going outside we also like to, to mix up the groups so that the smaller ones can benefit from the bigger ones and the bigger ones like to take care of the smaller ones. Here in the entrance every child has its own little spot with a little character on a basket where you can store personal belongings of the child. Our first room here you can see is our dancing room or sleeping room. After lunch all the children that have a regular lunch nap spend this time in here. Two adults are with them and helping them falling asleep. As you can see there are the same little clouds on the walls like on the small baskets in the entrance so the children can recognize their own places. For a hygienic reason the children always sleep on the same mattress with the same nushi and blankets and this has been washed also regularly. In the afternoon we use this room as a dancing or movement room as well so the children can come here to lose some energy, run around, play with balls or jump on the trampoline. On the other side here we have our slide. Also this has been used in the evenings for the children if they want to spend some more time with climbing and sliding. They are only allowed to slide down here when an adult is with them and when mattresses are put around it so that it's safe. Underneath on the mattresses the bigger children that don't sleep anymore after lunch they have here their rest time. One adult is with them and tells them a little storybook or they are listening to some music so that they can calm down. On our whiteboard here you can find all the important informations about our kita and about the quartier. You can find for example our holiday sheets where you can see when the kita is closed during the year. We are closed for the regular holidays and also for two weeks of uh, summer holidays in July and one week approximately in December for Christmas holidays. You can also find here our menu plans for our lunch and afternoon snack menus. Those are always prepared fresh here in the Kita by our staff. Once a week we make sure that it, there is a meat menu and once a week a fish menu for lunch. The other three days we have a vegetarian menu. We used to serve various food and we make sure that we only have once a week pasta, once there is rice, potato, couscous etc. We really take care that we have a healthy and good nutrition for the children. For the babies we used to also cook some self-made uh, fruits or vegetable purees which is made out of a bio fruits and vegetables also by our team. For the snack in the afternoon we first serve some seasonal fruits. Afterwards there is also some healthy bread, cheese, crackers that fills the belly of the children a little bit and gives them some more energy for the afternoon. In the morning we also serve some morning snack around 9 o'clock. This usually is just the seasonal fruits we have. The next thing you can find here is our team board. You can see who is working here in Kita. At the moment we are seven women taking care of the children. We are five educators that finished their apprenticeship or studies and two apprentices that are still studying. In January we have a new apprentice starting. 
Here in this corner you can see is our changing table. This is where we change the diapers of the smaller children. You can also see that we have some potties around here in case they would like to start the potty training. It's quite funny here because the children can climb up themselves on the changing table by the stairs. They really like that. Further here we can see is our first group room. This is the room of the stars group. In here the stars group is, is playing when we are inside. They are having their snacks and lunch times here at the big table and the small table. On the whiteboard you can also see the crafts activities we are doing with the children. Usually we discuss with the children a topic concerning to the season which is taking us about five weeks. Concerning to the topic, we are doing some crafts activities. With the small ones, of course, it's more easier stuff like footprints, handprints or sensory bins. With the bigger ones, we also do some cutting, gluing or other funny things together. Usually we hang up the crafts here on the whiteboards, also in the sunshine room you can see one, so that the parents can see what we are doing during the day. The next room here you can find is our sunshine room. In the sunshine room we have the possibility of two different rooms. They have a playing area where they can play with dolls, with the little market, the kitchen or with some Legos or other building stuff. In front there is the room with the tables. Here is the room where they eat, where they do crafts or where they play board games. Outside we also have a little backyard. This has been used by both of the groups, but usually only in the evenings after coming back from the park if they still want to catch some fresh air, or in summer when it's really really hot we can play here in our paddling pools. Usually otherwise we really spend our time outside in the parks nearby the Kita. In summer we really try to go outside for longer outings, for about two and a half hours in the afternoon, so we can also go to the zoo, which is reachable here with the tram, or to other further parks. There sometimes is also some paddling pools where the children can also splash in the water. I really hope you enjoyed our small visit through the Kita Kids Zone. If you have any further questions to us, to our team, to our work, please do not hesitate to contact us. Thank you so much for your attention.